Traffic Policeman Hand Signal The importance of the traffic policeman hand signal The traffic policeman hand signal substitutes the role of traffic control devices. It is intended to control traffic. There are also different meanings behind the traffic policeman's whistle that is based on principles, rules and meanings related to traffic. The traffic policeman hand signals. Signal to stop vehicles coming from the front of the street. The policeman is facing incoming vehicles. His right or left arm extended at a straight angle. The inner palm is to the front, while the other arm is tucked to the side of the body. Signal to stop vehicles coming from the back of the street. The policeman's back is now facing the vehicles that need to be stopped. His left or right arm is raised at a right angle, aligned to the shoulder. The back of his palm is facing the coming vehicles, while the other arm is tucked to the side of the body. Signal to stop incoming vehicles from the front and the back. The policeman is facing the coming vehicles. The left arm is extended straight and upwards. The inner palm is in the direction of the coming traffic. The back of the policeman is facing the traffic coming from the back. His right arm is extended straight and aligned with the shoulder. The back palm is also upwards towards the traffic. Signal to stop vehicles coming from the front. The policeman is facing the coming traffic. The left arm is extended upwards and straight and is aligned to the shoulder. The back palm of the policeman is also upwards in the direction of traffic and incoming vehicles at a straight angle. The policeman at this point is moving his arm to and fro so that drivers facing him can understand the traffic signals that he is making. Signal for moving vehicles coming from the right. When the vehicles are coming from the right, the vehicle coming from the front and back must completely stop. The left arm is extended and aligned to the shoulder. The back palm is opened upwards, aligned with the shoulder from the right side. The forearm and the palm are at a right angle with the brachium. The motion of the forearm and the palm is sending out traffic signals. Signal for motion of vehicles coming from the left. When the vehicles are coming from the left, the vehicle coming from the front and back must completely stop. The right arm is extended and aligned to the shoulder. The back palm is opened upwards aligned with the shoulder from the left side. The forearm and the palm are at a right angle with the brachium. The motion of the forearm and the palm is sending out traffic signals. The sounds of the traffic policeman whistle signals have specific meanings and the driver has to pay attention to them. A short whistle followed by a long one. The short one is a warning. The long whistle is to notify the driver to stop. A long whistle followed by a short sound. The long whistle is a signal for the drivers to stand by. The short one tells the drivers to go ahead and drive. Consecutive short whistles. This informs the drivers they need to drive faster. Long consecutive whistles. This warns the drivers and pedestrians to stop. And they should simply comply to the traffic policeman's signals. 
This whistle is also used to increase caution.